<laughs> it's like 3, 3.30 3 in the morning, making food. That's how I roll. Making fried cheese. Because I can. Oh man, fried cheese is my favorite. Seriously, this is just cheese. That's all this is. This is so good. One of my favorite ways to eat cheese. Yeah, you just take a piece of cheese, bleh, throw it on, melt it, spread it a little bit, wait till it crispens up, and then, oh my goodness. Awesome. My favorite way to enjoy cheese. Mmm, so good. Yeah, I made myself a... Uh, Cheese and friggin' uh, chicken burg quesadilla. 3 30, I was up all night, up all morning, talking to uh, one of my new friends from the YouTube land. Yeah, he's over in Ohio. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Fork is still hot. Good morning, guys. I, uh, I gotta get down there. I gotta beat the man in brown. Cause, uh, I wanna record him. <laughs> so, I'll see you guys down at the shop. I'm just looking through the Pennywise now. I saw an ad last night where the dude buys old catalytic converters and scrap metal, but I can't find it. I can't find it now. I got three cats that he can come pick up. Just can't find it. <laughs> there, I found it. Sweet. So now I gotta make the guy. Gotta make the guy. I gotta phone him. And then uh, I'll see what he charges or what he pays for cats. Uh, there's another one in here, so I'll compare them. See which one will pay the most. Make my card. Man, the crows are loud today. Where'd you guys get there? Yeah. There's two right there. They're so loud today. Shut up! Uh. <laughs> well, that uh, catalytic converter guy will be calling back. Um, apparently, the truck's in Elston, the guy that I got a hold of is just a guy that takes the calls, so, yeah, hopefully charge, or pays a bit, I don't keep saying charge, but uh, I gotta go get that other cat off the frame down here, so that I uh, have him all ready for when he comes, I'm also uh, giving him one of my crap radiators, it's, uh, Got no mounting brackets on it, they fell off. <laughs> so, it's no good to me, but it's still a lot of aluminum and stuff. It's tightening. My bad. Yeah, I just gotta unbolt it. And I'm gonna end up breaking my knuckles. Ah, oh, you sons of bitches. Just don't sting me, and I'll be happy. There's the front of my truck. <laughs> That's pretty gross. Burgers, anyone? <laughs> Here's my windshield. It's just splattered. Bug guts are really hard to get off your truck, too. <laughs> oh, my radiator. It's just caked. <laughs> Rick. Oh, that sucks. Should have put a screen mesh right in front of it or something. That way it protects from that kind of crap. Dang it. Buddy's uh, coming over tomorrow morning to pick up the cats and the rad and stuff. Um, depending on how much he pays, I might, might get a spool locker for my truck. That'd be sweet. That'd be really cool. But, uh... Actually, you know what? No, I shouldn't do that yet. Because I need to uh, save for moving. But that would be nice. 
That'd be definitely nice, but uh, can't do it, I guess. I'm having a hell of a time with steering. This one isn't long enough. It's short by four inches. So I either have to make like a four inch extension for that, or what I did with this one, I drilled out those little plastic uh, things or whatever, and I made this one the proper length. The only thing is, that end is a lot bigger than that end, so I don't know what the hell to do. It's very frustrating. <laughs> I really don't know what to do. Like, I don't want to cut that thing and extend it or whatever, because I don't have any tube that will like slide over this or whatever, and I don't want to friggin' have it go all cattywampus on me, so I gotta, I gotta figure something out. There's this option, I could go, I could put this little antler on there, and then I got a little uh, extension antler that bolts this, it's two inches, but like, frick, this thing won't go all the way onto there, so I can't put a bolt in it. And besides that, I stripped the crap out of the bolt when I first put it in, because I uh, had this thing on slightly crooked, and when I put it on, it friggin' got stuck and had to un, uh, had to wind this guy out, and it just wrecked the threads, so now it won't thread in, so I don't know what to do. So, yeah, buddy just showed up with the part. That's cool. Thank you. Uh, I just went down to grab this guy, and he's bringing me both parts. Tear this open, I'm excited. <laughs> Couldn't wait to get into this sticker. Sweet, they gave me another sticker. Cool. Yeah. Show gear. Apologize. Let's check these bad boys out. Man, that is freaking beef. Aww. Undercoating's chipped. Or the. Not undercoating, damn it, I'm tired. <sighs> Powder coating, that's what it's called. Yeah, this one is. Yeah, chipped in the same spot. Yeah. Hope they beg their pardon. Just had a bug on my leg, son of a bitch. Okay. Well, these things are super beef. I need them because, uh, my transmission the transfer case mounts are mounted with polyurethane so I can't use the stock rubber mounts because my engine will flex and the transmission transfer case will not so something will break so I had to order up these guys first impression is holy crap this is beef um, I don't think I'll ever break this <laughs> these things come with the no questions asked lifetime warranty so, I guess they stand behind the button. <laughs> Holy, high grade frig. This is awesome. Yeah, so, with these though, I'm gonna feel a lot more of the engine because uh, the rubber absorbs some of it, most of it. These will not absorb any of it. So, yeah, I expect that when I rev it, she'll go like, vroom, vroom. <laughs> friggin' twist. Yeah, so, there we go, Bob's your uncle. Now I just gotta wait till Sunday to start taking Beastie apart. That's gonna be a tough day. <laughs> yeah, this truck's helped me move a lot, and I've helped a lot of people move with it, and yeah, done lots with this truck. But, uh, yeah, the frame's not so good, so... Yeah... Oh well, she'll live on. Now I gotta figure out this thing. This is a non-serviceable part, like it doesn't even come out of there. So, what I think I might have to do is cut it there and there. Then I'll take this little nubbin, this is the one that goes from outside into the cab. And I'll cut this end off and then, like that, should work. Well, first impression is it's not going to fit. But I think I have a three quarter inch drill bit, so I could just ream out that, uh, dang it, I did it again. Ream this part out so that it slides over there. 
Or I could turn this down on the lathe, depending on if this is a solid piece. It looks like it. So yeah, I guess that's what I'm going to be doing. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. I'm cooking pizza right now. It smells like it's done. <laughs> it's been, oh my goodness. It's been in there for an hour. <laughs> nope, nope, an hour and... Oh my goodness. It's just decker. Son of a bitch. <sighs> Stupid memory. <laughs> well, I do like uh, a crispy crust. Let's see how uh, let's see how it is inside. You know what? It's not actually not actually that bad. Hmm. Maybe. Oh, I don't know. When did I put this in? Did I put it two twenty or? I honestly can't remember when I put it in. I think I think I might have put it in at one twenty. So it should have been ready at like 155. No, 130? Crap, I don't know. But uh, I'll see if it's edible. <laughs> I'm hungry. I couldn't have been in for that long. Like, I think I'm good. I think it was only in for half an hour. Not an hour and a half. <laughs> I think it'd be a lot more black at 400 degrees if it was in for an hour and a half. I beg my pardon. Dinner time or late lunch. Well, I got my custom shaft all designed and stuff. I cut the stock end off this guy and took this one down to the lathe and machined it down. I also had to machine this surface down a little bit so it would fit in there. But uh, yeah, fits really good. It's gonna stay straight and yeah, just gotta weld it now. Friggin' rights. Well, just finished welding it. Freaking right, I did. Alright, let's get this bad boy in. About time. Hello. Hello. Oh, I got the steering bolted up. It's all done. There's my custom joint thing. <laughs> it's got a, a little bit of wobble to it, but it's not bad. But, uh, yeah. So now the steering's as done as it can get right now. The only thing I got left to do is, uh, Hook it up to the motor. I thought this was hilarious. Check this out. Spiderweb, 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 spiderweb. They're all over the lawn and I didn't even know it until I turned the sprinkler on and it started getting them wet. <laughs> They're everywhere. They're everywhere! Power guy never showed up so, uh... I guess dad got a hold of them and took care of it, so still got power. The bug just flapped my nose. <laughs> I still gotta go over to that parts truck and pull another uh, length of brake line and redo this one because it's way too short. It's gotta reach to that back one there, so maybe I'll go do that because oh, I'm, I'm uh, kind of running out of stuff to do on this right now. So might as well do what I can, while I can. I'm perfectly capable of doing it right now, so. Yeah, I gotta get this thing drained so the guy can come pick it up. It's all brass or copper or whatever they used to build these out of, so. That's worth a bunch. Like, I'm not gonna sell it to him unless he gives me a good deal for it, because. Like, I could fix it. It's a perfectly good rad. It works fine. Holds pressure and stuff. But, uh, just the tabs broke off, so I can't mount it. Maybe, maybe I could use it for the uh, little project, uh, the super tanker. I could probably use it for that. Well, I only ate about half of that pizza, so the rest of it's done at Grandma's still. I'm gonna go get it, because I'm hungry. I gotta make sure the cats are away too. Buddy's not here. And Adrian's not here either. So now I gotta go cat hunting. Oh, never mind. Cool. Hey, buddy. Where's your brother? Where's your brother? Where's Adrian? I don't know where he is. Oh, I'll try the old bag of cat food trick. See if that. Shh. 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 Sleepy 
cat food trick works. Yeah, uh, that's great. Come on. Come on, me. Go oh, on, noms. All right, have a good day. Hello. How are you? Just got my pizzas, is that okay? Old pizza is always the best. <laughs> Again, with the, f <laughs> the forgotten outro. <sighs> When am I gonna remember that? I don't know. But uh, it was a pretty good day today. I uh, got a lot done on the Forerunner and everything. Um, yeah, we'll see what tomorrow brings. <laughs> Take care, guys.